2020 has been a real year of looking at the changes uh moving forward in your life what it is that you want and it's been a wave of emotions a wave of planetary movement and how it's affected every single one uh no one would have escaped 2020 let's put it that way and it's almost it's been like if you see yourself like the compass it's almost like twisting you in the, whatever direction you need to be in to head in the direction that you need to go in okay thank you and what they're saying is your soul has been trying to guide you so it's not that your soul is an exterior part of you. You are the soul's actually in your vessel that you uh, see, feel and hear right now where you are. But it's like many who hear this may not have totally um, come on board or totally tuned into the fact that your soul is still trying to guide you. But some of you just don't hear. And I'm to blame as well because I'm a human being as well. Uh, as our soul has almost like sent those breadcrumbs out on our footpath on our, our journey to sort of show us to redirect us to what direction to head into but if we if we okay if we don't have a sometimes a magnifying glass or glasses on or our eyes our wits about you then how are you going to know or what you're looking for so by doing the work of tuning in by doing the work of um, tuning yourself in as in working with your psychic abilities, your gut feeling, your intuition. If you, if you don't get them on board, if you don't start tuning them in, if you don't start working them as like in muscles, then it's going to be harder for you to actually see your clues. <laughs> they just gave me the Cluedo, who, um, the game Cluedo, who was murdered in what room or whatever. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why you're giving me that. Um, but Okay, that makes sense, I've got you. Someone's got a sense of humour and they're loved on the other side. So they're trying to get, your soul is trying to give you clues. Your soul is trying to lead you down the right pathway. That Your soul is trying to help you to live um, to, the, to your best, to, your, to live to your higher purpose, to, to fulfil your mission and why you're here. But it needs that help. It has to have that assistance from you, first of all. Okay, thank you. It's a bit like, it's like driving um, a, a motor car in the sense of learning about the gears, the brake, and, and getting into neutral, first, reverse, whatever. It's a bit like that. You, there's just such, you can't expect that um, a person gets into a car and puts the hand on the steering wheel and then moves about with the foot pedals and knows exactly how this vehicle's going to work. And it's a bit like yourself, your soul goes into your vessel, your body, and it needs some assistance in like with yourself. It needs to help you to become more in tuned. Okay, so having the, okay, being aware of wanting to move forward, being aware of stretching yourself, being aware of wanting more is a good thing, but it's also about you becoming more in tuned, uh, you know, doing those meditations. No, they, they just said to me, we keep saying meditation, meditation, meditation. And it's almost like saying, you know, listening to your mother saying, eat your greens, you know, don't forget that pee on the side or have your vitamins and minerals. It's the same thing. It's with that meditation, it sort of takes that needle off the record so, sort of thing and stops the mind overthinking and sort of allows you that time to think. They're very much aware that there must be a lot of different people how they're feeling right now. So, okay. And one of the biggest thing I was told, you know, over the last couple of days was very much, you know, I'm having my own human experience, of course I am, but they're very much trying to make us all aware at this time that, you know, in this month of January and moving forward into February, it's about, facing head on into your challenges and not running away from them because this is a brilliant time to sort of let go of things for each and every one of us myself included uh, you know what comes up for you what's facing you in the face it's about looking at that and and just moving through it it's not running away from it